Good morning everybody, Ian Gilder TV Travel Shop. It is 11 a.m. and do I have the best three travel deals for you. The first is an amazing short haul, the second is a stupendous long haul, and the last, which is my favorite, I like to call it the erection section, <laughs> sorry, family show. Um, is it a cruise? Is it a bucket list or is it a sport event? These offers get supplied to us by, <laughs> sorry, I'm still laughing, get supplied to us by our tour operators, travel agents and hoteliers. Um, in by the droves, the team who are all extra um, travel professionals go through the offers, they find um, the best offer, they find the most varied. We, we just don't want to give you all the same places. They check to make certain it's using good quality accommodation and it's a hotel that they would stay themselves. Um, secondly, it is the best, best price in the marketplace. And last but not least, in my opinion, um, the most important that your money is protected by the weight of either APTA, Atoll or Trust Surface. Onto the short haul section of the show, comes from the guys and girls at Hology, the four and five star holiday experts. And do I have a deal for you? This is an absolute cracking deal, going to the good old resort of um, Melia Bay in Malta, a place that I've never been. Malta is obviously an island, um, great weather, um, lots of culture and history there, but things to see and do. You can go to Popeye Village. This is where um, the, the film Popeye was actually made. So it's got all the film set there. Um, there's a water park you can go to in um, Bagiba. It's all about the sandy beaches. Um, where you're staying is the number nine place to go visit on TripAdvisor, which is Miliha. Um, other things to go, go out and see is get yourself on a boat and go out to the, I think it's called the Blue Lagoon. And also get on a boat and go over to Gozo. Gozo is like a harbour front, love nice shops, nice restaurants. Just sit there and have a chill. So where will you be staying? You'll be staying at the Four Star Hotel Solana. It's ranked number two out of 17 hotels in Melia. Um, it's a TripAdvisor's Traveller's Choice award-winning accommodation, and over 80% of guests have rated it either excellent or very, very good. It's um, a sophisticated hotel, so people like that me go to, obviously. Um, it's in the heart of Melia and offers a great choice of food and drink options. Um, the hotel is just um, 10 minutes walk away from the beach at Melia Bay, which, as I say, is number nine of things to do in um, Malta. And the highlight is the rooftop terrace with a pool. So literally go up there, have a sunbathe, have a pina colada, as Marlene would say, and just enjoy yourself. It comes spectacular in the nighttime as well. Facilities include the rooftop pools I mentioned, um, which has amazing views of all the other sister islands as well. There's a fitness center. Um, there also has an indoor swimming pool during this, um, so if it's going in the winter, it's gonna be nice and warm for you. There's also a spa and wellness center there as well. Has choices of restaurants. You've got the Bellini restaurant is the main restaurant, is buffet style. The prickly pear offers seasonal menu with dishes, including um, local Mediterranean um, dishes. And if you love authentic med, you've got the Tosca, which is an award-winning restaurant as well. And this has very, very good seafood. So the accommodation is based on an economy room, so it's not really the biggest room in the world, but you're just going out there for a cheap break. Um, air conditioning, Wi-Fi, coffee making facilities, um, satellite TV, all en suite, things you would expect. So price includes return flights from London, including hand baggage. Flights from regionals are available at a supplement. Private return airport transfers. Seven nights B&B on an economy basis. Leading price is based in March from only 209. Then April 249, May 279, June 339, July 419, August 489, September 399, October 319, November 249, and December 219. November at 250, because it's actually it's not that cold there, is a great price. So seven nights, four stars, second best hotel in Millia Bay, B&B from 209 a person. If you fancy this, click through on the link and go through to the website, dial the number on the screen, hit the inquire now button, which is also on the screen. Um, seeing it on Facebook, like it and share it. Give us a comment if you've been to the hotel. Insta, give me some Instagram love, or if you're on the YouTube channel, hit that subscribe button, and enable notifications to get the best travel deals in the marketplace. If you're viewing this, you don't quite fancy this, go through to our website, www.tvtravel.shop, where we've got over 200 offers currently loaded. Onto our long haul offer. Comes from the guys and girls of Hology again. They're submitting some great deals. And this is a five star to a British favorite of Cancun. 
Um, the hotel they're using is an absolute cracking hotel. Um, but why do people go to Cancun? One, the weather is stunning near enough all year round. Talcum powder, sandy white beaches, crystal clear waters, water sports, great bars, great restaurants, great nightclubs. Um, you have the jungle which you can go explore, you've got the cenotes where you can go and see um, all the local wildlife and creatures. However there's other things as well, you've got a lot of ancient history, um, you've got Tulum which is one of the national or new wonders of the world, so one of the seven wonders of the world at the moment. You can go to Excaray which is a ecological water park oh, and where it has shows and animals etc etc which is going to be great great fun to go out. You can go to Chicken Itza. Again, another ancient ruin. So there's so much to see and do. To get a four by four, go out into the jungle, zip lining. There, as I say, it's a great place to visit and you don't need to just be stay in your hotel. The other reason it's so popular is the hotels are so, so good and such great value for money. So Hology have put this offer together and it is uh, one of the UK's favourite accommodation, which is the Five Star Dream Sapphire Resort and Spa. It's ranked number 12 out of 43 hotels in Puerto Morelos and is uh, rated either excellent or very, very good in 85% of its reviews. It's around about 25 minutes away from the hotel zone, um, but this is uh, like a resort type of hotel which you're going to be going to. It has its own private beach with um, lounges and shades, non motorised water sports included in the price of snorkeling and kayaking are available. The resort has three oversized swimming pools uh, which are heated and also cooled if need required. A family friendly water park, a um, fitness centre which has all the usual facilities, daytime activities right we're ready for this include tennis, beach soccer, ping pong, euro bungee, I've no idea what euro bungee is, bicycle tours and board games. Um, you can also get complimentary golf green fees at the Grand Coyote Riviera Maya Golf Course. Evening and entertainment includes big screen TVs, theme nights and spectacular shows and for children there is a children's club. You will be staying in a deluxe junior suite with tropical views. I think that means it's got a tree outside um, with air conditioning, sofa, ceiling, um, ceiling fan obviously, 24 hour room service, tea making, you get a tub with a shower, marble floors, it is a beautiful beautiful um, accommodation. Looking at this, room upgrades are available to including a preferred club junior suite beachfront with swim out, so speak to the guys in Hology, they can upgrade it. Price includes return flights from including baggage, return transfers, 10 nights preferred club junior suite on an all-inclusive basis, um, preferred club benefits with a private adults only pool, access to the preferred club lounge, access to the spa's hydrotherapy circuit, and free green fees at the golf course, which I mentioned earlier. I mentioned one place which you go and see, which is Excaray, so you can add on an Excaray Plus tour from only £135 per person, which includes a range of shows, activities, food, drink and more, so speak to Hology about that. Um, there's other dates available, um, you can go for more, more, more nights if you choose to, but the price they've got is based on 10 nights going in September between the 8th and 29th. You can go from Gatwick from only £14.29 per person, so £140 per person per day, flights, transfers, all inclusive, lots of restaurants lots of bars great great deal or you can go from Manchester from 1559 fancy this click on the link go through um, call the number on the screen hit the inquire now button like it share it on Facebook give me some Instagram love subscribe to that YouTube channel and name notifications if you don't fancy this or you want to see what else we've got in Cancun click go through to the website www.tvtravel.shop and do a little bit of a search Now, my favourite section of the show, as I said earlier, is it a cruise, is it a bucket list, or is it a sporting event? This is a cruise combined um, with a bucket list for many people. It's a place that I've never been. I've sold this holiday so many times. I reckon I've put 3,000 people here. Um, one of the best sellers. Absolutely love it. And I can understand why. If you're a, friend, if you're a fan of Elvis, the king, uh -huh, this is the place that you want to go. Adore Cruises have put a triple centre holiday which I think you're going to love. So this starts with flying into Memphis where you're going to have three nights centrally, lo centrally located hotel in Memphis where you're going to see the best things. So the number one thing on TripAdvisor isn't Graceland, it's actually Sun Studios. Sun Studios is the first, um, is where 
um, Elvis recorded his first track. It's still a working um, studios now, so you can go spend some money and they'll um, record you. I'll tell you one thing, I'm not gonna waste my money because you know I can't sing. Um, but people like U2 still um, record there. It's the home of people like Johnny Cash, he's recorded there. And a lot of other famous artists from the era have literally started their careers at Sun Studios. Second, number two on TripAdvisor is actually Graceland. And included in your price is gonna be a Graceland um, tour. You're gonna go around, wear your headphones, and they'll take you all the right way around there. It's like a guided tour. Um, you'll get to see that the, the house is the same as the day that Elvis died. So literally there's big box TVs, it's very 70s. It is a kind of literally exactly as it seems. You're gonna get to see places like his, um, where his car collection, um, his aeroplane. So this is, a, if you're into Elvis, this is where he lived um, many, many years ago. So obviously the highlight for many, many people. Other things to see, um, home of the, the, the Civil Rights Museum. This is where Martin Luther Kip King was shot, it's the Lorraine Motel. Again, like a Graceland, the hotel is exactly the same as when um, when he died. So when the shot got ref um, fired from the refectory um, above the room, it's exactly how it was. It's really very, very poignant, um, very, very interesting, and very, very informative about how the, the kind of Black Lives Matter uh, and it, how it's all changed over the last few years or over, over the, the, the time, so that's a great thing. Evening, got to go to Bill Street. Bill Street is obviously where Mark, Mark Cohn sang We're Walking in Memphis. L lots of bars, restaurants, you've got BB Kings. So there's lots of nightlife to go and visit. There's other things as well to do in Memphis, but literally they're sort of your main three or four. Then, after your third night, you're going to catch catch the Amtrak train. It leaves around about half past six in the morning, and you're going to go on down to New Orleans. You're going to have three nights centrally located to stay in New Orleans. Um, New Orleans, things to do. One thing I always want to do, because I want to go to New Orleans, is um, take the Hurricane Katrina tour. Obviously, the, the city was decimated 10, 12 years ago. A lot of the city is still decimated, so you can go see how the, the, what areas they've built back up and what areas are still affected. You've got the Natchez steamboat, which goes up the Mississippi. Take that in the evening, you'll get a... Um, some southern fried um, chicken and uh, barbecue sauce, etc. Food included with a jazz band plan as well. So that goes up there. Again, you've got the French Quarter. So we've seen the French Quarter in many, many films. Um, you've got music, you've got blues, you've got literally, it's a very, very vibrant and cosmopolitan town. And if, if you're into a little bit of voodoo, that is uh, the home, it's like where all the voodoo people go as well. So a little bit different, a little bit quirky, and some great bars and restaurants. So after this, you're then going to have a seven night four board crews on the Carnival Pride. I'm not gonna say too much about Carnival, let's roll the video.
So we've just found out what Carnival all about. I love Carnival. I worked out the other day, I've actually cruised with them nine times myself. Um, why do I go with Carnival? The food is fantastic, um, great value for money. You've got, the, you've got the comedy club there, you've got the theater where it does some great shows, casino, it's generally a slightly younger crowd, <laughs> me young, um, kind, of, kind of enjoy their self. It, as I say, got all the facilities. You've got Guy Fieri's burger joint. He does the dirtiest burgers I've had. Absolutely fantastic. You've got the Red Fog Pub, the Blue Cantina, um, Taco Bar, which I, I eat many lunchtime. The Steakhouse is unbelievable. Arguably one of the best steakhouses that I've ever been. There is a cover charge for that. You've got a great Italian where it's like um, you all dive in and help share in places. I just love Carnival. So it's a seven night cruise going around the Caribbean. You've got a choice of three itineraries. Um, all include Cozumel. Cozumel, great place to visit. Um, what do I do? Get yourself out to Shackenab National Park. $20 taxi fare. Like um, It's like a, a national park, obviously. You've got a nice beach there, you've got a swimming pool. You've also got um, swimming with the dolphins. It's, it's the cheapest place that I've ever swum with the dolphins. So that's all great, great fun. Um, you've got Carlos and Charlie's, whether you go in there, it's all about getting drunk, tequila, limbo dancing, bar wars, one ship singing against another. You've got Senor Frogs. If you want some cheap jewelry, it's kind of gold and silver out there. It's very, very cheap as well. So I love Co um, Cozumel. Other ports of call include Grand Cayman, Key West, uh, Montego Bay. If you go to Montego Bay, my top, my recommendation would be jumping an uh, um, organised excursion, get yourself up to Ocho Rios and do the Duns River Falls. That's great fun going up the mountain, going up, up the falls. One word of advice, it is really, really cold and maybe take an old pair of trainers as with you as well because it will help you grip on a little bit. Um, so that would be, again, another one of my top tips. Um, so there's a choice of three itineraries. Other one includes Key West um, and Nassau. Key West, obviously, is south, south, southernmost tip of the USA, um, the home of Hemingway. Um, great for sunsets. Again, that's a kind of go out, have a bit of fun. A couple of things you can do there, parasailing, or there's a shark tour, which I quite fancy. Never got around to doing that, but I actually fancy the shark tour. Or Nassau, get yourself over to Atlantis, Paradise Island, you've got the, um, there's a market there. Or you can also go swimming, swimming with the pigs. So again, lots of things you can do in these places. So, so when you phone through to Adore Cruises, they'll be able to give you some advice on that as well. So, what does the price include? The price includes flights from London, including your, um, including your baggage. Regionals are available. Three nights room only in Memphis. Free tickets to Graceland. Amtrak train from Memphis to New Orleans. Three nights room only in New Orleans. Seven nights full board cruise, including your entertainment, your port taxes, your food. It is an unbelievably good price. So how much is this gonna cost me? I've got lots of prices in front of me, but the leading price is based going in either January or December 22, or January and February 2023, leading in for an inside cabin at 13.99 per person. So that's 13 nights at 1,400 quid, three iconic places that you're gonna be going to. If you want an outside cabin, it's 15.99, balcony 16.99. There's a lot they do, this runs all through the year. So like March is only an extra 100 pound per person. April an extra 100 per person, May an extra 100 per person. So hopefully the prices will be behind me. I'm not going to read them all out because there's too many. So if you fancy this, click on the link, go through to Adore Cruises and um, give them a call. Hit the inquire now button. Um, if you're seeing this on Facebook, give us a like and a share. Instagram, it needs some Instagram love. Or if you're seeing it on YouTube, hit that subscribe button, enable notifications to get the best travel deals in the marketplace. If you don't fancy this cruise, but you want some inspiration, go through to the website, www.tvtravel.shop for the best travel deals in the marketplace. Stay safe and see you all tomorrow.